left-hander Andrew Heaney, the second year of his two-year contract with these Texas Rangers, making his second start of the season. First start here at Globe Life Field. And Jose Altuve wastes no time, per usual. Goes after the first pitch, and that's a pop-up to second base. One pitch, one out. Jordan hits it sharply, and no chance for Simeon or Seager. It splits the two middle infielders. Jordan Alvarez has a hit here with one out in the first. Another close one. He didn't get the call on 2-2, and he didn't get the call on 3-2 either. Tuck draws a walk. Back-to-back -back full counts. Tucker drew a walk on a 3-2 pitch, and now Bregman has a full count here. Bregman into left center field, dying quickly. That'll be down for a hit. Good read by Jordan. He's going to score. There is Bregman's first RBI since game two of the year, and the Astros in front, one to nothing. Talked about how good this offense is, and that's without Bregman getting going. And that one is in, ball four. That'll load up the bases for Jeremy Pena. Still just one out and an early visit from the pitching coach, Mike Maddox. Uh, Pena, another guy that's got pretty good numbers. Three for seven career against Heaney. So a big spot early for the Astros trying to add to this lead. Ground ball towards the hole. Seager backhands the second for one. Pena beats the throw, and that'll be a run scored for the Astros. Jeremy Pena's speed makes it two to nothing. Here's the one-two offering. Struck him out swinging, got him to chase a high fastball at 91. Expected from Valdez to make the start tonight. He will not make the start for the Astros. Found out there's a little bit of an issue with that left arm, but it opens up an opportunity for a young man. It is Blair Henley's turn to make his major league debut tonight. He went to school just down the road here in Arlington, and tonight he's going to get an opportunity to show his stuff right in his backyard. And there's a four pitch walk to Marcus Semien. There goes the runner. The pitch is swung on and popped up into short center field. Coming on is McCormick, and it dunks in for a base hit. Simeon got a great read. He'll scoot around to third, and the Rangers are in business. Runners at first and third. Nobody out for Wyatt Langford. Astros scoring two in the top half, and the Rangers are threatening right now in the bottom half. And this ball hits sharply up the middle. That's a base hit. Simeon scores, and Langford drives in his sixth run of the year. Rangers battle right back, chip away with the run. He kicks and fires, and it's swung on, smacked up the middle. Diving, Dubon has it, throws long to first, and it's bobbled at first base, and everybody's safe. Henley needed it, and the bases are loaded, still nobody out. Seeger at third, Langford at second, Garcia at first. Well, he goes with a fastball, and he misses. A base is loaded walk. Carter brings home another run. He's faced five batters, hasn't retired any of them. The one, two. That's way in. In fact, they got a piece of Smith, and it brings home another run. The bases remain loaded, and the Rangers are now up three to two. It is a lonely place when you make your major league debut on that mound, and you can't quite find the zone, and that has been the case for Henley early on. There is no place to go, there is no place to hide. You just have to figure it out on the fly. That one hit out into left field. That's trouble. Drops in. Base hit. One run is in. Here comes Carter. He'll score easily. A bloop two-run single for Jared Walsh. And it is five to two Rangers. Popped up. Go. Abreu and Dubon converge. Dubon will call off Abreu. So there is the first down for Henley. Man, that's low ball four. So they are loaded up. And after nine batters, Joe Spot is going to have to come get. Blair Henley. Congratulations for making his major league debut. It just did not go the way that he had hoped. Here's the one two and that is hit sharply to Dubon. Good flip to second for one and Pena returns it for the double play. As we play in the top of the second. This one punched in the shallow right and that was going to fall in. Victor Caratini has himself a base hit. That's his first at bat of the season batting right handed. This is Jordan's 27th game played at Globe Life Field. He has eight home runs so far in this ballpark including last night's game winner. And he crushes one deep to right field. Jordan admires this one. It is well back with the stands and the Astros have made it a one run game. It is now five to four Rangers. We could have hopped on that flight, been halfway to Kansas City. That was a bomb. That might cause an eclipse. It was up in the air long enough. It was a 431 foot bomb. The 1 1. Swing and a chopper. Heaney leaps, can't get it. Charged by Corey. Bare hand pickup, throw to first. He got him. Nice play by Corey Seeger. Jose does have good numbers against Heaney. And he gets wow. hit by that pitch. And Dubon shoots that out to left field, but. Carter, able to run that down with some ease. 
Caratini strikes out swinging. Here's the pitch inside ball four. Heaney walking Altuve, putting runners on first and second with two outs, and he will leave this game. Astros have the go-ahead runners on base. Jordan striding to the plate already has a bomb under his belt. Hooks one down the line. That's a fair ball to the corner. This game's at least tied. Altuve being held up at third as the Astros have knotted it at five. Jordan Alvarez with his third RBI of the night. Blair Henley's favorite player is that guy right there. Spit the hook, young man. Altuve on third, Alvarez on second. Now Kyle Tucker, the batter. He hits it hard through the middle. That's going to score two. In comes Altuve. In comes Alvarez. The Astros lead this game 7-5. to five. Kyle Tucker, a two-RBI base hit. He leaves with the lead. Jeremy Pena shoots one to right center. That's going to fall in for a hit in front of Adolis Garcia. So Pena has his first hit of the night. He's now one for three. He drove in a run on a fielder's choice earlier in the game. And he bounces this one first base. Walsh will go to second, and they get the out there. 1-0. And that's a ground ball through the right side. A base hit for Dubon. Abreu stops at second. And the Astros have two men on with one out. Obviously, you want to keep the pressure on if you're the Astros, mm -hmm. leading 7-5. to five. Caratini sends one high and deep to right field, sending Garcia back. He's at the wall. This ball's gone. Victor Caratini, who hit all seven of his home runs last year left-handed, has his first as an Astro. It's a lefty home run, and it's a three-run shot, 10-5 to five Houston. And the Astros continue to get production out of the nine hole of the order. This time it's Caratini with a big three-run shot. Walsh, the runner at first, 0-2. This one is a little looper, tough play. McCormick and Alvarez. Jordan oh with a diving attempt. Does he make the play? No signal yet. The throw, the call is an out. And back goes the runner to first. A delayed call. The big man went down to the ground and made a play. And Chaz saw his life flash in front of his eyes. Luckily, Jordan is able to lay out, avoid contact, and make the play. We're going to head to the bottom half of the ninth inning. Astros lead 10-5. to That's a five-run game. Certainly a tall task for the Rangers now. And they haven't done before, though. And they have to do it tonight against Brian Abreu. And the first pitch to Tavares is hit well to center. But gliding over there is the new center fielder, Jake Myers. And he runs it down for out number one. Now their first pitch swing. This is Marcus Simeon. Kyle Tucker tells Jake Myers, I've got this one lined up. Two pitches, two outs. One, two. Man, that one hit sharply into right field base hit. So Seeger is on. Seeger keeps the game alive. He has a three hit night going. Into center field, playable for Jake Myers, and that should do it, and it is. It's a 10 5 Astros victory tonight at Globe Life Field. They did it in grand fashion, putting up 10 runs to protect a youngster who had a little bit of a rough outing to start with.